I'd like to hear your opinion as a, a congressman representing uh, Texas and uh, your role on the Foreign Affairs Committee about the president's threats to close the border. Um, I'm deeply concerned about not just the impact on sort of the U.S. and Mexican economies, but also on the willingness that Mexico has shown, even in the last week, to work with the United States on uh, stemming Central American migration. And secondly, what the, the potential impact it might have in the Mexican Congress as they're looking to ratify the USMCA yeah. agreement. Mm -hmm. So I went down to the president, President Obrador's inauguration. I, I've chaired the U.S.-Mexico IPG for 10 years, and I've been very involved in it. Yeah, they're my neighbor to the south. I don't view them as an enemy. Uh, they're our largest trading partner, uh, Texas. So you know, if I think, I think if you seal the border, you're going to cut off significant trade, and it'll have a significant you know, impact on the economy. And I think the president made that statement out of frustration. I think he's very frustrated that we have 100,000 per month now trying to get in, into the country. And that's probably why he's threatening to cut the foreign aid off as well. I mean, he, he's in a very, uh, you know, we tried to change some of these laws, but we were unable to do that. And so uh, I think he's doing a lot of this out of frustration. I don't think he's going to actually, see, you know, completely shut off the border. It would have a significant impact to uh, in our economies. And I, I forgot what